I just wanted to get, really share with you what it's like being a host family. We've had uh, students for two years, and just last, just Friday night, we were coming back from dinner. We were laughing over the things that Yuki had said or something that had happened. And my son Nick said, even two years later, he said, you know, that was my senior year, and that was the best year of my life. And these little tough boys, little tough guys, I remember seeing them weep at the airport as their friend left. It's so touching even as I think about it. It just touches my heart. And this is what I want you to know. I was trying to think of what would be meaningful and I thought, you know, to share their first Christmas, to share their first Black Friday shopping, to share their first eating a hot dog in the car because they don't eat in cars. They are so helpful. They probably study 20 to 30 hours a week. I've never, it's like the teenagers you always dreamed of but you've got to import them from around the world. <laughs> And the peer accountability with them, with how my kids observing how they are, the peer accountability, I just think the whole thing made us, it's a, just a richer family experience. We're more mindful about what we eat, about how we would discipline our children, you know, how you might just mouth off or say something that might be a little rude, you might not say it like that in front of people. It's just true. You're more mindful about how you talk to each other, and uh, so, they're kind, helpful, studious. They do the dishes every day. Mine always did the dishes. Like I never, I didn't know how to act. It was just lovely, and uh, we we're extremely excited about having them again for the third year in a row. So if you're, and if you think you're busy, get two instead of one, because I'm too busy for all that need for attention all the time. So I got two, so they could always have a BF for someone to hang out with. So it worked out great. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome.